Hello, 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 everyone. Welcome back to Dining with Desica. On today's menu, we have my delicious skillet chicken and mushroom served over mashed potatoes done my way. Let's get started and do this. Using a small glass bowl, I'm going to add my dry ingredients. One half cup of all-purpose flour. Next, one tablespoon of thyme flakes. Next, one tablespoon of chicken seasoning. A half teaspoon of kosher salt. Also, we're gonna add, that is one teaspoon of black pepper. Also, one and a half tablespoon of garlic powder. I'm going to whisk these dry ingredients together and I think I'm going to switch into a larger bowl with our flour and set it aside. Next I have that is a pound and a half of boneless chicken thighs and I am going to lightly batter each uh, piece of uh, chicken and I'm going to set it aside on some parchment paper and uh, we are going to complete this by seasoning each piece of chicken very lightly you don't want to heavy coat it with the flour okay and I have preheated my stove top to a medium high and I am using a cast iron skillet that's what we will be uh, browning our uh, chicken thighs, okay? And look at this. This is almost completed. Once again, everyone, this is my delicious skillet chicken and mushroom served over mashed potatoes okay okay we are completed next we're going to move to our stove top and our cast iron skillet i will add three tablespoons of unsalted butter and we are going to let that butter melt completely and we are going to place our lightly floured chicken thighs in the skillet Remember, the temperature should be a medium high. Uh, you want to make sure you fully cook each piece of chicken. And I am going to let brown until it's a caramel color. So I'm going to flip my chicken thighs 8 to 10 minutes per side. So we're talking at least about 20 minutes to 25 minutes. And until they are golden brown and as you guys know i always do do the taste test as i go along to make sure that my uh, chicken is fully cooked next in the same skillet i'm going to add that is two tablespoons of butter and i'm going to melt this butter i'm going to turn down the temp just a little bit uh, to a, a low temp and I'm going to stir fry my delicious Bella mushroom and this is a 12 ounce uh, carton of mushrooms I'm going to use the whole cart next I am going to use one cup of chopped scallion onions and we are going to uh, add this in the skillet as well and I also like to take the time to mention that if anyone who can't tolerate mushrooms can also use broccoli or cauliflower, okay, with this recipe. Next, I'm going to add that is three chopped uh, garlic cloves, and that is one tablespoon of Dijon mustard. And we are going to blend these ingredients together, and we're going to let saute for about five to six minutes the most and next we are going to add one and a half cup of chicken broth uh, next that is one cup of a half a cup of dry white wine mmm a half a cup of heavy cream next two teaspoons of cornstarch dissolved in two tablespoons of water or you could have used it inside of your chicken broth either or 
Next, you want to stir. We're going to stir and stir and stir. Look at this. This looks so delicious. Okay. Everyone, we are going to let simmer for a good 10 to 15 minutes. This is such a delicious dish. Once again, this is my skillet chicken and mushroom served over mashed potatoes. Okay, everyone, as a reminder, please do not forget to visit my YouTube channel, subscribe, like, comment, and share, and don't forget to go to diningwithdesca.com. Next, I'm going to place our delicious fried chicken, butter fried chicken thighs into our skillet with this delicious sauce. Okay, and we are going to actually let simmer another 10 to 12 minutes at least, everyone. Voila, it's ready. Next, I am going to add, that is some fresh parsley flakes, everyone. And this is going to complete this dish. I already have prepared some mashed potatoes, so I do have a platter that I have prepared. And I'm going to add my homemade uh, butter milk mashed potatoes done my way. You have got to try that recipe as well. We're going to add a nice slice of chicken thigh over on top. And I'm going to place some delicious gravy over on top. Mmm, this is so delicious, everyone. This mushroom gravy, you have got to try it. It's more of a sauce, so it is delicious. This is, once again, my skillet chicken and mushroom served over mashed potatoes. It is time for the taste test. Mm, I'm just going to dig in. Mm, mm, mm. Mm, mm, mm. Oh my God, this is so delicious. I'm going to slice some of this chicken thigh. Mm, mm, mm. I want some mushrooms. Mm. Look at this. Mm -mm. It's a must try. Mm. Mm -mm -mm. This is so delicious, everyone. Once again, please, everyone, please don't forget to follow me on my YouTube channel, Dining with Desica. Please subscribe, like, comment, and share. Also, you can reach out to me on diningwithdesica.com. That's my uh, website. You can also support the channel by shopping on the product uh, page as well. And you can download the Dining with Desica cookbook, uh, Cajun and Southern recipes done my way. Also, everyone, you can also find me on uh, my fan page, Dining with Desica, on Twitter. Instagram and Facebook, which is my fan page. So I look forward to you guys following me, joining me, supporting the website as well, so that I can continue to bring you these delicious recipes that you must try. Once again, this is my skillet chicken and mushroom uh, dish served over on top of my delicious buttermilk potatoes done my way you can also find that recipe as well um to everyone i like to thank you guys for subscribing following me showing me support and love as always until next time love is love please stay safe smooches